Scientists funded by the European Research Council have made an extraordinary discovery in the field of astrophysics, being shared now in a series of scientific papers. We discover for the first time um, gravitational waves at very, very low frequency by monitoring an ensemble of millisecond pulsars. The frequencies being picked up by the researchers are at 10 orders of magnitude lower than those observed by ground-based detectors Virgo and LIGO. This groundbreaking discovery has been made possible by over 25 years of observation carried out by the European Pulsar Timing Array Collaboration. What are millisecond pulsars? Those are very uh, compact stars that produce beams of radio radiation and spin very quickly. As they spin, this beam of radiation intercepts the line of sight to the Earth, and is, they are essentially cosmic lighthouses. By timing the pulses of these millisecond pulsars, we can, we can detect the breathing of space in this, uh, with this technique. The ability to observe very low gravitational wave frequencies has opened up a second gravitational wave window, bringing astrophysicists closer to previously unobservable astrophysical phenomena. We believe that the signal comes from merging supermassive black holes when galaxies collide. The physics of this is poorly understood, but we can use that signal eventually to understand what is going on when these two galaxies merge. And with even more precision, maybe in 10, 15 years, we can then also test fundamental aspects of general relativity. For instance, has the graviton mass? What is the propagation speed and so on? There is an intriguing possibility that this newly detected gravitational wave signal may have originated from a process that occurred in the early stages of our universe. This tantalizing prospect may offer cosmologists and fundamental physicists a unique opportunity to peer back and see what happened closer in time to the Big Bang. It marks an exciting new chapter in the field of gravitational wave astronomy.